you wrote a blog post in response to a person looking for advice about whether with a CS degree to choose a nine to five job or to uh, become an entrepreneur. It's an interesting question. If you just think from first principles right now, somebody has took a few years in programming, has loved software engineering. In some sense, creating Python is an entrepreneurial endeavor. That's a choice that a lot of people that are good programmers have to make. Do I work for a big company or do I create something new? Or you can work for a big company and create something new there. Oh, inside the... Yeah, I mean, big companies have individuals who create new stuff that eventually grows big all the time. And if you're the person that creates a new thing and grows big, you, you'll have a chance to move up quickly in the company to run that thing. If that's your aspiration, what, what, what can also happen is that someone is a brilliant engineer and sort of builds a great first version of a product and has no aspirations to then become a manager and grow the team from five people to 20 people to 100 people to 1,000 people and be in charge of hiring and meetings. And they move on to inventing another crazy thing inside the same company, or sometimes they, they found a startup or uh, they move to a different great large or small company. There's all sorts of models. And sometimes people sort of do have this whole trajectory from engineer buckling down, writing code, not nine to five, but more like noon till midnight, <laughs> seven days a week, and coming up with a product and sort of staying in charge. I mean, if you take Drew Houston, Dropbox's founder, he is still the CEO. And at least when, when I was there, he had not checked out or anything. He was he was a good CEO, but he had started out as the technical inventor or co-inventor. Yeah. And so he was someone who, I don't know if he always aspired that. I think when, when he was 16, he already started a company. So maybe maybe he did, but he sort of, it turned out that that he ha he did have the the personal sort of skill set needed to to grow and and stay on top and other people sort of are brilliant engineers and horrible at management i i count myself at least in the second category yeah, so your 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 first love and still your love is to be the quote unquote individual contributor so the programmer yep 